Okay, I really, really, really resent that I can't. I've even tried to contact WhatsApp. It's the most useless company to try to contact. But I can't decipher, and I would, uh, these WhatsApp texts to explain to you why the writing style is not mine. It probably sounds a bit like me, and I'm guessing. Now, I was thinking about this. Teresa and I, my sister and I, speak very similarly. You can play the tapes. Even the way that we pronounce things, right? Uh it's it's similar right so we have a similar tone we use similar words we grew up in, in the same demographic and we're sisters even though we haven't lived together the foundations of our language uh started together so if someone's mimicking my voice to be honest with you my dad's a very good writer but he would kind of probably drop the ball a little bit because he's so socially awkward on making it totally convincing to sound like it comes from a 34 year old woman from from my background with sort of a 90s dialect throwback kind of thing with a modern modern take as well but Teresa can nail it effortlessly because we nearly it, go play the tapes dude. don't can't you be like oh dude they, they do say jokes in a similar manner now if it's written in an extraordinarily bitchy way uh, Teresa is super harsh you don't know because she comes on camera and she delights you and all this shit but Teresa is ex exceedingly harsh um, with her criticism. Oof. Oh, you think I'm bad. Oof. She's exceedingly harsh and she doesn't like women. I'm just saying, does any of this reflect in there? She doesn't, it's not that she doesn't like women. It's that she can compete really hard with them. Um, because Teresa puts a lot of her identity in being hot. So she can be especially critical of women's looks. Um, so I'm just saying, look for any signs of Teresa on this. Um, and I would like to point out, Teresa and I do t speak similarly. However, she works with kids and is not, her language is not as advanced as mine. So Teresa, it's not that she can't speak on a more advanced level. She can, but she doesn't. And so when she writes, she or speaks it's usually between a sixth grade and a tenth grade level whereas I, when i speak and you have enough tapes of both of us to compare it mine's normally on what like an eighth grade to a, a collegiate level even that word alone she wouldn't use so and my texting does have specific things now, i'm a lazy texter so i don't do punctuations capitals anything like that you see anything like that you know it's not me right um but I can't, I mean, it's like hard for, I can't decipher what, what I don't know is written. This is hard. Also, when I do auto text, auto to speak, it will write it differently than I do. And I do this about half the time. So that does skew it. And my, honestly, my auto te to type thing really sucks and ends up writing words. That's like, that's not even the word, but it kind of sounded like it. So look, analyze the what's up text. And I want you to analyze the... Now I know it's text and sometimes you can get lazy and you know, you might not write collegiate in a text, but especially speak to text, that's going to be how I speak. So if it doesn't sound advanced enough, you guys have heard it. You're like, what a intellectual bitch. But what level is it? Because if it's at Teresa's sixth to 10th grade level, I'm calling it, dude, I'm feeling it. That's why she took pride in that. But you'd have to tell me, I can't guarantee it. I'm just, she would be able to mock my voice nearly, not voice, but the way that I speak nearly to a T. And, and you, we are different people, but play the tapes. Can you tell that we're sisters when we speak? Mm, bingo, dude. I'm looking at you.